Hey, what's going on YouTube? UA Reviews here, and today I've got a review video on the Under Armour Sonic Short Sleeve Compression Tee. Alright, so I want to go over a couple detail aspects of the shirt and uh, just kind of show you guys some things that are new and that I thought that were really neat. Uh, but first off, I'll start off with the, um, the collar up here around the neck. Uh, the collar on the shirt is actually, um, the top part up here is actually made of a uh, mesh breathable material which uh, is definitely different from the original compression shirts uh, that Under Armour has. Uh, what makes it different about from the Sonic, they just, um, I feel like it's, you know, it feels, it fits better around your neck. It just like, I don't know, it just like, I couldn't hardly feel the collar around, which I don't really have a problem with, but I mean, some people, you know, maybe not want, you know, it, it just feels more natural um, to, from what I think. Um, but that runs all throughout the collar. It has, just kind of has a little mesh. Um, collar around it um, definitely another thing that I thought was really awesome is they changed up the seams on the shirt um, they have changed the seams up on the top part of the shirt around the chest have mostly for the most part on some Under Armour shirts have been uh, flat lock seams um, but what has changed on the Sonic is that all the seams on the shirt uh, that run down the side of the shirt are all flat lock seams on both sides and I know those are a little hard to see because um, it's a bright red shirt um, but uh, I definitely think that that aspect that they changed uh, the seams running down the shirt it just feels like so much more natural like I said wearing it. it's like you're it's like the compression feel you don't even feel it around you it's just it feels just natural um, around your body um, and definitely that's just my major theme of this video is just how natural the shirt fits. Um, I can tell a definite, a definite difference from wearing the uh, Under Armour, the original compression shirts for so long. And then a big difference between this one, it just feels, I mean, there's no, I don't really find a difference between uh, the cool part of it. Like it's, it's still heat gear and wicks away sweat very nicely. Uh, I've never had any problem with any Under Armour product not being able to wick sweat away. Um, it's just, I think it's just an awesome shirt. It's definitely a cool upgrade. It still costs the same as uh, the the old uh, regular compression shirts. I'll here show you the back here. It's kind of, I mean, there's just a lot of, uh, you know, just uh, cosmetic, you know, just things they did with this shirt that are just definitely different. You know, they changed it and put, you know, Under Armour on the back here and changed up the little locker tag thing. Um, but, you know, it's just, I love I love this shirt. Uh, it's definitely become one of my favorite compression shirts to wear. I'm definitely probably going to get a, uh, a short sleeve one, or I mean a sleeveless one and then a long sleeve as well. So, I just, it's just one of my favorite shirts right now and I will definitely give you guys a uh, fit review and just show you how it fits. I don't, there's no really size uh, change between these shirts. Um, I wear a 2XL in Under Armour's uh, regular compression wear. Uh, I still wear a 2X in this. So I'll give you guys a fit review and we'll wrap this up. All right, so here's the Under Armour Sonic uh, short sleeve compression shirt. Uh, I'll just kind of give you guys just an overall look and how it fits before I start talking here. I'll just kind of give you... Um, so, I definitely, you know, just, I think this shirt's definitely a, a cool upgrade from the um, original compression shirts. Um, it definitely has like a, a, like a slick feel to it. Um, it just, it, like, I have, I feel like I have a lot of range of motion just because um, the seams sometimes would run down the side and they just kind of feel, you kind of have to get it adjusted right. I just think like, the, you know, the way I use these shirts is you know mainly just uh, working out, running, etc. And um, I just you know I like the compression feel on your against your skin. Um, it, you know it definitely um, it's just a big help. You know it's just a thing that I'll you know just have to have when I work out. It's just a compression shirt, and this is just one of the most natural compression shirts I've ever got. So and if you can kind of see the collar, it it fits really loose around, but it, you know it fits tight enough. To where it's not constricting uh, that was a big thing that you know i like to have you know a sh you know it's not gonna be bugging you or anything but um sleeves come down a little bit um 
a little bit uh, longer than normal, but uh, you know, they, they might kind of dry up once uh, you start using it more. And you know, if they go in the wash, you know, they might start to. Um, I definitely wouldn't put this in the dryer or anything. I definitely would just let it hang dry. I'm going to give you kind of the length of the shirt there. I've got it kind of pulled down over my shorts right now, but um, good length to it. Um, so if you guys have any more questions on this, <clears throat> I'd like to know what you guys think about this shirt. If you guys have this shirt, uh, let me know how you like it. Um, this was just something that I wanted to review. And uh, I'm kind of giving, I kind of want your guys' opinion on it too. If you guys have this shirt, you know, what's your thoughts on it or if you've seen it. Um, I definitely will be getting um, a couple more of these, maybe try out their own, they have compression shorts in this style too. So I, I will definitely try those out. But uh, let me know what you guys think. And uh, don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Twitter at UA Reviews. And with that, uh, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.